Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a drawing using a roller drawing sheet. And today we're doing roller merker. So we've got bodies, heads, arms and legs, eyes and mouths, and lots of extras to add to your drawings. We're going to start off in, uh, if you're doing this in your visual diary, it means we're planning. So we're going to divide our page into four. And this gives you the opportunity to play four games. Now, you're not playing against other people, you're just playing your own game, you're just sharing the dice that you need. So you're not competing with other people, you're just creating a drawing. Okay, the way you start is the first person has a go and you quietly roll the dice. Um, we're not shaking the container, just rolling it very quietly. Uh, everyone making a big loud noise, we're not going to be very nice for rolling. Now I've rolled, I don't know whether you can see that, but I've rolled a five. And we start off on the first row, which is our body, and I come across to where I've got a five, and I'm drawing this body. Now I want you to fill up a lot of the space, so you want to have, put this in the middle, leave some room at the top for a head, and leave some room at the bottom for some legs, but you want to very carefully draw this body as big as you can. You don't have a rubber, so you need to draw right the first time, okay? By the time you've done your drawing, everybody else has probably had their go, and by now the dice will be back to you. So let's go down, we're going to do, roll the dice again. I've rolled a two, I don't know if you can see that, but I've rolled a two. Okay, so I come across to the head now, and I'm putting this head on. Hmm, okay. Well, I'm going to make sure the neck comes out to here. I'm drawing very carefully. If yours doesn't turn out exactly the same, that's okay. But we're roughly looking for that head. Okay, now that you've been, while you've been drawing, everyone else has been having their turn and hopefully it's come back to you. So I'm just going to roll this again. <gasps> I rolled a six. Can you see that? I rolled a six. Hmm, six. Now, <laughs> for every other one, if I rolled a six, I get a free choice. But for the legs, I don't. Ah. If I'd rolled a free uh, a six up here, I could have picked whichever head I wanted. But I'm on legs now or arms, so I'm going. Yeah, I'm going to use this one now. I need to decide: do I want to use these for my arms or my legs? Well, I think I'm going to do two of these, and I'm going to draw my legs with this one. So. Like I said, they don't have to be exactly the same, but pretty close to the same. So there are my legs. Everyone else has had their turn, comes back. I need to do this again because I need arms now. Because I use these ones as legs, I could have decided to use these as hands, but I've decided to use these as legs. I've got to have another go to find out what I'm going to do for my arms. And I've got a one this time. So here are my arms here. If I come underneath one, I'm doing these arms here. So I'm going to have one arm coming down in front of the body. These kind of match my feet a little bit. That's pretty cool. So I've got like this. And I'm going to have this arm. And I'm going to tuck it behind here. So I can, it's behind that side of the body. And I'm going to draw it waving. Some, there we go, that's pretty cool. Okay, everyone else has had their turn. Now I'm up to eyes and mouth. I don't really need a mouth because I've already got a mouth, so let's see what I roll. Oh, I rolled a five. Well, that's a mouth. Everyone else has their turn. I've got to wait because uh, let's see if I can roll a one, two, three, or a free choice. Yay, I've got a six. So I've got a free choice. So I've decided which eye I'm going to put on here. Hmm, I think I might do this one here. I quite like this one, so I'm just going to do a circle and do an eyelid like that. There we go. All right. Now, I've basically finished my person, but it's looking a bit boring, isn't it? So now I get to do some extras. So it's my turn again. I've rolled a five. Great, I've got some flowers. Now, I might decide to draw these down the bottom. I might actually make them a decoration on my creature's uh, dress. It looks like it might be a girl creature. So I'm going to draw 
these flowers on here. And I don't have to draw them exactly the same, but I'm drawing flowers that look a little bit like this. And I might draw some here. Hopefully while you're working, you're all working very quietly so that the people who are drawing when they're, while everyone else is having their turn uh, gets to concentrate on what they're doing. So this is a very quiet game. That's why we need to roll our dice very quietly. I rolled a two that time. We can come down to here. <gasps> I've got this. Okay, I'm going to add some decoration in my corner. Because if you remember looking at Mirka Moira's uh, drawings, now if you're a bit complicated with these, start in the middle. So there's my middle, and then I've got one, two, three, four, I've got eight petals. So I've got a big petal coming up here, and a big petal coming down here, and a big one here, and a big one here, and then I've got some little ones in between. Okay, and then there's some lines in the middle. And then I just go around the outside with an outside bit. Oh, I like that. Now you might decide to draw a couple of these, or you might just want to draw one. I'm just going to do one. If you're happy with your drawing like that, you can leave it, or you can keep rolling for extras to finish off your drawing. Okay, I've got a free choice here, so I'm going to go back up to this one, and I might draw some leaves growing up here. And I'm pretty happy with my drawing now. I've got something on both sides. I've got a plant growing up here. I haven't scribbled. I've drawn fairly neatly. I've thought about what I was doing as I'm drawing. And I've concentrated on my drawing. So that's my first Merka Moira character or creature. Once everyone's finished their drawings, or even before other people are drawing, if you're up to it, when it's your turn, you can just go on and start your second one. So having a roll of the dice, I got a four this time, so I'm drawing this one. And I just go into my second one. You don't have to wait for everyone else to keep going. You're just sharing the dice. You're doing your own drawings. Um, yep, so have fun with this, guys. And at the end of the class, you will have four different Merkamora creations. Have fun.